Cleveland, Ohio, Major League Baseball will not levy a fine nor impose punishment against the Houston Astros after a man associated with the club was caught in the photo pit aiming his cell phone and did to the Cleveland Indians dugout during Game 3 of the American League Division Series on October 8. The same man, who was also issued a media credential through the Astros for the American League Championship Series, was caught near the Boston Red Sox dugout during Game 1 on Saturday after the club was warned by Indians officials. MLB officials issued a statement Wednesday saying an investigation was conducted after several teams inquired with the commissioner's office about possible sign stealing. The statement indicated the league has beefed up security at all postseason games in response to the inquiries, and that the league considers the matter closed. According to the statement, the individual was acting on behalf of the Astros to ensure Houston's opponents were not violating any rules. The league has warned all teams remaining in the playoffs not to engage in similar efforts, and to instead refer any possible rules violations to MLB staffers. The complete statement from Major League Baseball is as follows, before the postseason began, a number of clubs called the commissioner's office about sign stealing and the inappropriate use of video equipment, the concerns expressed related to a number of clubs, not any one specific club, in response to these calls, the commissioner's office reinforced the existing rules with all playoff clubs and undertook proactive measures, including instituting a new prohibition on the use of certain in-stadium cameras, increasing the presence of operations and security personnel from Major League Baseball at all postseason games and instituting a program of monitoring club video rooms. With respect to both incidents regarding a Houston Astros employee, security identified an issue, addressed it and turned the matter over to the Department of Investigations. A thorough investigation concluded that an Astros employee was monitoring the field to ensure that the opposing club was not violating any rules. All clubs remaining in the playoffs have been notified to refrain from these types of efforts and to direct complaints about any in-stadium rules violations to MLB staff for investigation and resolution. We consider the matter closed, reports surfaced Tuesday about the incidents in Cleveland and Boston, identifying the man as Kyle McLaughlin, an associate of Astros owner Jim Crane. McLaughlin has been removed from media photo areas near both the Indians and Red Sox dugouts so far this postseason. Red Sox general manager Dave Dombrowski told the Associated Press prior to Wednesday's Game 4 of the ALCS that he does not think McLaughlin was stealing signs, but that the issue may not be completely resolved. First of all, there was a violation, Dombrowski said. A person was in the credentialed box that shouldn't have been there. He wasn't supposed to be there. Secondly, I don't like the implication that the Boston Red Sox were doing anything illegal, and I don't think that the issue is actually closed from Major League Baseball, from what I've been advised from the commissioner's office, so there's a lot more steps that are attached to this, Astros GM Jeff Lenau told reporters before Game 4 that Houston was being proactive, but the club will obey the league's directive moving forward. We were playing defense, we were not playing offense, Lenau said.